Alright, what's up everybody? Okay, so today we will be going to the East again. We're going to Jewel today. And let me show you guys what I'll be doing there. But now we're gonna we're gonna flash that. Alright, so we are at Pinkfish already, we are at Jewel. Okay, so this is the restaurant right beside the waterfall. Okay, so I'll be doing one of their stuff. So we're gonna go in and find out their menu and we see what's there. Okay, let's go. Okay, so they don't really have a very big menu, okay? So I'll probably be getting all of their items, like the entire menu. So we're gonna... I'm gonna try to avoid all that spicy stuff, because the other time when I did the full menu for Carl's Jr, there was a lot of spicy stuff. We will try to avoid the things that I don't want, then we'll order whatever, the rest that we have. It looks very healthy though, so we're gonna see how it works. Okay, so I've assembled my giant kingfish platter. Okay, so I've got three of their signature wraps. Their wraps are actually very, very big. They're way bigger than I expected. Three of their wraps, okay, all cut into half. And then three of their signature burgers, which is, uh, okay, all, all of their items, they got three variations, which is the Asian, the, the Asian, the European, and the American. Okay, so, uh, and then I've got their, it's something like a rice bowl kind of thingy, like uh, they call it. I don't, I, it's not exactly a poke bowl, but it's something like a salmon that is like rice that that say that again. Rice that is topped with salmon. Okay, and then middle I got a soup. I chose the American soup, and then okay. So this one, this one is this, the month, the catch of the month, which is like salmon, fish, and chips with like a salad at the bottom. Okay, so. Oh, caught fish, okay, okay. I said that again. Okay, so this one, this is actually the catch of the month. Uh, like every month, they got some sort of special. This is actually caught fish, caught fish nuggets with a uh, little salad at the bottom. And okay. Okay, so I'm gonna start eating. Okay, I know what I'm gonna start first. I will probably start with the wrap first. And then uh, because this has been looking at me for a while, so it's like a wrap. <laughs> and we can see how it goes. Okay. This, if I'm not wrong, is the European wrap. The wraps are really big. This only, oh my god. It's really saucy. It's actually very good. Okay. For the wraps, right, you can actually choose, there's like, you can actually choose it in either the form of salad or wrap. I pick wrap because I've got enough salad here already. So I pick in the form of a wrap. This is actually, uh, this one is actually the American one. It's got onions and some sort of like, Oh, it's actually what sauce is like super good. American wrap is more sauce. American wrap, uh, that one. Okay, there you go. American sauce. <laughs> no, it's not American. Their wraps are very, very saucy. Oh my god. I'm trying my best to not let it look at it. Huh? Uh, European is masala. European is the Okay. So this is the European wrap, right? The European one. They actually added this Middle Eastern sort of like a sour sauce which is very good like everything just comes together very nicely
try my best to to, to be clean. Yeah, so this one, uh, the American wrap, is actually topped with like Caesar dressing with salmon. It's got crontons, onions, a uh, bunch of healthy crontons, right? Crontons. It's got crotons, it's got salmon, a bunch of healthy vegetables inside. I really like the onion. The crispy onion really like brings out all that flavor. Okay, I'm gonna try one of the burgers. Oh, the burgers are huge. Oh my god. It's not the Asian one. Look at that. Yeah. You go right in. Asian one's the sauce, huh? For burger. Which oh, burger? Black Asian, pepper. Asian. Black, black pepper. pepper. Okay, it's actually a black pepper sauce. Really good. I never really like expect salmon. The salmon patty to go so well with black pepper sauce. They added mango salsa as well. Wow. All that flavors though. This black pepper sauce got a very nice kick to it. Okay, next up. Try the American burger. It looks like a typical hamburger. That's like I don't know. I think they added like barbecue sauce and coleslaw inside. Yeah, like a typical American barbecue. You know, this looks heavy. Yeah, I'm just gonna go right in. <laughs> Oh, it's good. Oh. Okay, that, all that combinations, right? I really didn't expect it to go so well with a salmon patty. Okay, I don't usually eat salmon burgers because, like, I don't know, like, you can't find much salmon patty burgers in Singapore. It's very rare. Okay, but this is one of the, this is one of the restaurants that offer here in Jewel. The table will make messy. Yes. Okay. I'm gonna clear up. Yeah, okay. Clear. Right back. Let me just clear up the mess. All the wrapping. Okay. By the way, all of this wrapping, everything that you use to hold the food, to plate the food, everything is biodegradable. Okay. This is one very interesting thing about kingfish. Everything you can throw it back to the ocean, and yeah, it's very nice environmental friendly. But don't go and throw it in the ocean <laughs> in Singapore. You guys are gonna get fine. Okay. I'm gonna finish the burger and the wraps this. Yeah, okay, next up. I think this is the European burger. Okay, among all three burgers, this one looks not. Okay, the other two is very saucy. This one don't look so saucy. Wait, let me wipe my mouth first. Like, uh, so difficult to keep everything together. Wow. This one has this... Is... It actually tastes Indian and the spice. No, legit! Like, it tastes like a... Very like... North Indian kind of spice. I don't know. It tastes like I, I could taste that yogurt inside. Like you know the yogurt when you put in chicken, like the 
chicken tikka masala. I don't know. I have, but yeah, um, the spice is sort of like a very Indian sort of spice blend. Pretty good. Right, let, me, let me take another bite. Okay, it's definitely that yogurt, some sort of yogurt sauce inside. This is my favorite so far. I mean, for the burgers, why? Okay, I take that back. It's actually very saucy. Also. <laughs> I kind of forgot which wrap is this. I'm not sure if, I think it's the Asian one. This one got kiwa inside. I think that's the way you pronounce it, kiwa. Yeah, let's try. Mm. I actually have to talk to one of the staff. I really have no idea what sauce to do. But I really want to find out what sauce is there. Okay, let's go. Last rep. It's very big though. This is really just bowl of soup. This bowl of chili right here. It's got all sorts of like because when I eat the burger, the coleslaw drop inside. When I eat the <coughs> the wrap, the quinoa drop inside. So it's got all sorts of goodness in it. Okay, uh, okay so we're done with half of the plate. Okay, so we're left with like the, the more healthy stuff, okay? So these are all the... Um, oh shit. I don't wish to speak again. Just not <coughs> the wrap, right? The quinoa one, right? Inside got what sauce? Right? Okay, so for us, right? Um, because the Norway their sauce right, it's a different language. Okay. Then they never tell us anything. But it might be good. It's okay, you can give us Yeah. It's a rather not easy. Okay, but never mind. Yeah, they're not inside, okay. The thing is that uh, I'm asking the I'm asking the very handsome guy like what sort of yeah, what sort of sauce inside because I can't I can't exactly like you know make it up. There's no idea. Okay, so uh, we can tell the ingredients. Uh, it's actually olive oil, lemon juice and normal sort of juice. And they use uh, a Dijon mustard and olive vinegar. Dijon mustard? Yeah, right. Okay. So it's actually inside there. Okay, so it's actually Dijon mustard. It's just very straightforward, very simple ingredients, but I think everything sort of comes together very nicely. But, anyways, uh, I'm gonna move on to all this. Uh, they call this raw, which is like uh, salmon. It's something like poke bowl, which is like salmon, like chunks of salmon, very big chunks of salmon. Well, with vegetables, all your healthy vegetables, and then the rice at the bottom. So the rice they use is Japanese rice. That's what I understand. And then uh, you get to choose, like you know, again you get to choose the like, Asian, uh, European, or American. Okay, now it's all mixed up. Like, I don't know which is which again. <laughs> We're just gonna eat. Okay, uh, I'm gonna get this one down first. This is the, uh, this is the codfish fish and chip. Fish and chip. Okay, so uh, codfish, little, little nuggets of codfish uh, with a salad at the bottom. Mm. Oh, green apples. I just added green apples inside. Wow. Oh. oh, a lot of dressing. I think you're supposed to eat it together. I don't know why I'm going to separate it. Really like you know 
more than halfway through. Eating eating healthy can be pretty tough as well. Okay, but uh, there's this. Yeah. This one, oh my god. Your rice at the bottom. Japanese rice at the bottom. Yeah, this looks like a typical poker bowl. I just put it here. Yeah, there's a bit of a changes in light. Okay, my videographer is trying to adjust. But anyways, uh, Can we adjust some this one is actually uh, it's like a poker bowl with like the pickled ginger inside. It tastes something like you would eat in a Japanese restaurant. I think this should be Asian, right? Is that Asian? Yeah, this is definitely the Asian flavor. Okay, as I mentioned earlier, right? Every each of the item, be it the wrap, burger, salad, or whatever, uh. It's got three different like categories, three different flavors, which is the Asian, European, and the American. I don't know where they like get the salmon from, but the salmon is very smooth. Like the texture is very different from the typical salmon that I've eaten. I'm, I'm, I'm talking about the raw ones. Really? Huh? It's Norway, eh? Norway. Same from all those all from the Oh, the ginger. Uh, okay, I'm now with the Asian raw. Okay, so uh, the Asian one, the one with the ginger and everything's gone. Now we're done. Now we're down to the. Uh, this is the American raw. Which is same uh, sushi rice, like Japanese rice at the bottom. This one, it looks a little bit different. It looks healthier to me because there is like broccoli and snow peas inside. Which, I don't know. Let me try. It feels very Asian to me as well. Sauce. What sauce is it? Spicy mayo, is it? Yeah. They added like the spicy mayo sauce on it, which kind of goes very well, like with all that, uh, all the vegetables in it. I will. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> One thing, Messi. Huh? Your your plate, yeah. No choice, man. Messi. Uh... I really try to like one by one here. <laughs> Oh, that's saying just now. Spicy meal. Yeah, I'm gonna see that again. Oh yeah, so this one, right? The spicy mayo actually goes very well with all that, uh, all that crunchy vegetables. Yeah, they didn't really like overcook the broccoli or overcook anything, so everything is still very crunchy. With that salmon, you know, that creamy salmon, everything just goes very well. Now. Okay, this is hands down my favorite raw. Oh, well, this bowl really got everything inside. <laughs> it's got a concoction of everything. I'm gonna save the chili bowl for last. Yo 
hope you're right. Thanks. Okay, we're down to the last one, the last raw, which is the European raw. This one got no cups. It's got no salad in I mean sorry. It's got no rice in it, no grains in it. So it's mainly a salad, which is like a very good low carb option for those that are like, you know, doing keto, trying to watch their weight and everything. It's one of healthy. It's, it's got beetroot, it's got like green apples, it's got mm, mm, I don't know, it's got salmon. It's got a lot of good stuff in it. so healthy right now. There's so much omega 3 though, men versus omega 3. <laughs> yeah. Down to the final item. Oh, this one's got everything inside. Okay, this is actually, uh, again, they got... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, we're down to the final item. We're again like the soup, they also got three options. This one that I picked is the American one, which looks like a little chili with like tortilla chips, which you can dip it and eat it. Anything on my face? Nope. Mm. Alright, so we're done with this giant platter from Pink Fish. Uh, okay, I'll be very, very honest. This, the, the food, right? The food here really exceeded my expectation. Okay, so I wasn't expecting, like, the combination of salmon with all the different sauces and everything to go so well but uh, they really exceeded my expectation okay so if you guys want to try this restaurant right again i am at jewel okay they only have one outlet currently which is at jewel uh, this very aesthetic restaurant right beside the waterfall uh, if you guys want to try do come here and try it out uh, it's pretty affordable uh very generous amount and like a good amount of protein for those bodybuilders out there you guys can come in, you know, because I'm, I'm, a, I'm a very biased towards salmon. So, okay, so, okay, that's it. I'm going to go ahead and end this video. Uh, still a little overwhelmed from all the sauce. Like, because, like, towards the end, all that flavor just come together. Okay, but anyways, okay, so if you guys like this video, remember to subscribe, uh, remember to like, and remember to hit the bell notification icon for those that already subscribed. And drop me a comment down below on what other restaurants that you guys want to see me rate. Not the R-A-T-E rate. It's the R-A-I-D. We rate the restaurant. Okay, but uh, okay, that's it, that's it. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye. Okay, so they don't really have a very bad. Okay, so they don't do it again.